welcome back to my channel for those who are new to my channel i am key and this is key's plan life so today i have something good for you guys i have not done a skincare routine video or anything doing dealing with skincare in a long long time so <laughs> i wasn't gonna order this but I don't know what made me order this y'all i really don't know what made me order this but i know as soon as it came out at midnight i was on it and it is none other than fenty skincare products so we're doing this unboxing and everything right now we're going to do a first impressions video right now so i feel like now um, the packaging is really pretty for the most part. I do feel like because this was her first skincare line that um, there should have been more to the packaging. You know, I love the inside of the box. I think it looks really, really pretty, but I think it should have been more to the packaging. So, so what I got in this box was the Fenty Skin Hydra Visor. And it looks like this. Now, this is a really pretty packaging. I got the Fenty Skin, and this is a toner. What is this? This is a moisturizer with sunscreen in it. Now I do like that her moisturizer has sunscreen in it, and I also like that this one this, that these particular products are supposed to be for all skin tones, even sensitive skin and skin that is not that sensitive. Um, this is the Fenty Skin total cleanser and it looks like this i got all these items i think for like 75 bucks or 73 bucks but it wasn't over 80 bucks so that was really good matter of fact i can tell you how much everything was right now because without showing you the information at the top those are the three products i got and let's see the it doesn't have the price it doesn't have the price on here but i know all together i didn't spend over 75 bucks for these products so what we're going to do is we're going to use these products today now this is a real life film i'm not going to make this bathroom seem how it isn't on a daily basis this is how it is on a daily basis Although that toilet paper is not supposed to be there. My husband knows that's a pet peeve of mine. But because we have a little drop little thing on the floor where we keep toilet paper in a little crate. But this is my bathroom, y'all. It's simple. It is straight to the point. It is a bathroom. Okay. <laughs> so without further ado, we're going to turn on some water and get some water kind of warm. And I am in the process of redoing my bathroom. I just don't know what I'm gonna go with. I know I'm gonna work off of this vibe in the back. Cause that's oh so sexy. I don't know if you can see it, but hold on. That is oh so sexy. So we're gonna work off of that vibe. But I am redecorating my bathroom. So I got the water warm. And I'm assuming that this is step one. This is step two, and this would be step three. So, we're going to braid the seal, and I love that her packaging has a seal on it that lets you know it has not been tampered with. I'm here for that. So, we're breaking the seal off of there. And I'm going to open this. So, it doesn't have a smell. Oh, and I wasn't supposed to take the top off. It doesn't come off like that. Okay, this is cute. So, this is how it works. You click it like that, and the stuff comes out of there. And then you close it back like that. Now, that was great, great marketing. You can hear it click. So, that's how you know it's open, and that's how you know it's closed. So, I'm going to be using my trusty um, facial brush. Let me get all my components right now. Rinse them out stuff off i'm using this and i'm not exfoliating so i'm not going to use my gray brush head 
I'm going to use something softer, which is the white one. It's just for normal facial washing. And I'm going to attach it to my brush. And we're going to open this. And we're going to take a little bit of that. And we're going to put it on here. I feel like a little bit is going to go a long way. I could be wrong, but I just feel like in my spirit, a little of this is going to go a long way. So I'm going to turn my little brush on and we're going to brush my face. I'm going to look at my mirror so I can see what I'm doing. Okay. It has, I smell cocoa in this. That is what I'm smelling in this. I smell a little hint of cocoa. So while I'm doing this, I want to tell you, well, I'm going to put the ingredients over here so you can see what the ingredients consist of. But the first ingredient is water. Okay, I need to see if I'm wrong. Does this have cocoa in it? Because I'm smelling it. I smell coco. They, they have coconut in it. But I smell like a cocoa like chocolate type of thing in there and most of these ingredients are kind of hard to read though I said I was gonna list them up here but I'm I'm it's making a nice little lather so I like that I could probably turn this water off before I do that this is going right up in here And I normally, when I wash my face like this and I'm using just a cleanser and not exfoliator, I'm normally doing this for like two or three minutes. Just really getting in there and cleansing my face. And getting all the nooks and crannies of my face. And a little bit definitely does go a long way. So it's not foamy. This is more of a creamy cleanser. It's not a foamy cleanser. But I like it. So I'm going to rinse my brush head off. And put it back to dry. And I'm going to close this because I'm done using it. I'm going to take my towel. And I'm going to rinse my face. Not scrubbing my face with the towel, but just gently getting this um, this soap off. It didn't irritate my skin. I don't feel any type of irritation or anything on my skin. It just it feels like a normal cleanser. So that's good. Because normally some like cleaning agents that you use on your face, you can tell if it's going to burn right away. But it says that her products are for sensitive skin. So that is good. I'm going to rinse my towel back out for my next use. I normally hang my towel out to dry. So the next thing we're going to use is the Fenty Skin fat water pore refining toner serum and I didn't tell you the instructions on the um, cleanser it says hyper clean soft skin without stripping or drying daily cleanser and makeup remover in one so you can use this as a makeup remover as well the directions is use day and night to remove makeup dirt and impurities wet skin work into a lather rinse for external use only uses directed so we did that the next thing is the toner. It says instantly refines the look of pores, reduces the look of dark spots, which is good because y'all know this came due to my um, due to sarc sarcoidosis. If you don't know what sarcoidosis is, look it up. But I have this because of that, um, and it's darker than the rest of my skin, and I've been trying to lighten it up to make it even. Um, so yeah. Hopefully this will help. And it says even skin tone and fight shine without stripping skin. Good because I am an oily girl. Direction. Use day and night on clean skin. 
apply over face with fingers. So I'm not going to use a cotton swab. And it did have a seal. When I turned it, it broke the seal. Um, it does have a seal at the top. So I'm assuming I'm supposed to take that off as well. And if you're using your fingers, by now your hands should be clean. So I'm going to take... Oh, that's why. Because it's kind of like a gel. Okay. It's kind of like a gel. Oh, well, I would advise y'all, even though it says you can use your fingers, I would use um, a cotton, cotton swab or something just because a lot comes out of there. And you're not going to need too much for your face. You just not. So I feel like I got everything and I still have a lot of product on my hands. So we're gonna wipe my hands with this towel and we're gonna close this back. So I will definitely, next time I use this, I will use a, because there's no way to like press down and it comes out. You have to turn it upside down for it to come out. And when you do that, a lot of this product comes out and you really don't need a lot of this product. So I would probably definitely use just these and put the product on and put it on my face. So the next thing is we're going to let this dry. But while we letting this dry and it doesn't feel... If my skin actually feels cool to be honest um, and like I said I'm gonna put the direct the ingredients for all this stuff up here in this corner but my skin feels really really cool and I'm just doing doing this so it can dry the next thing is um, the Fenty skin Hydra visor it's an invisible moisturized broad spectrum SPF 30 sunscreen you're probably like but I'm black or I'm of darker complexion, so I don't need sunscreen. Yes, you do, boo. We all need sunscreen. I don't care what your race is, what your nationality is. We all need some type of um, sunscreen because we all are subject to get skin cancer if we're in the sun too long, if we're sunburning, tanning. You need sunscreen. I don't care what nobody tell you. You need sunscreen. Um, so it says lightest air hydration, invisible sun protection, defends and brightens skin while reducing the look of pores. It's oil free. It's made with care for coral reefs. Does not contain oxabenzone or oxinate. Oxitinate. I think that's the word. The active ingredient is I'm gonna put it right here because I can't pronounce these words and I've never been one to make a fool of myself. And it says uses, helps prevent sunburn. If used as directed with other sun protection measures, see directions, it can decrease the risk of skin cancer and early skin aging caused by the sun. It says directions, apply liberally 15 minutes before sun exposure. Use a water resistant sunscreen if swimming or sweating. Reapply at least every two hours. So I'm not going to use this um, right now just because I'm not going into the sun, but I will take it out and just show you the texture, show you what it looks like and things like that. I think this is more if I knew I was going somewhere and I was going into the sun, I would definitely use this, but I'm not. I'm going to get ready to go to bed. So I think the cleanser and the toner is enough for my skin. And it says sun protection measures. Spending time in the sun increases your skin, your risk of skin cancer and early skin aging. To decrease this risk, regularly use a sunscreen with a broad spectrum SPF value of 15% or higher and other sun protection measures, including limited time in the sun, especially from 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. I like that she put that there. Wear long sleeve shirts, pants, hats, and sunglasses. Now, I'm sorry. But it's going to be kind of hard to wear pants and long sleeve shirts when the weather's like a hundred and something degrees but you can wear a cute little big hat or take an umbrella sometimes i use an umbrella so i'm gonna open this so you can see what it looks like and when i'm opening it it says fenty skin love your skin respect the planet refill me so separately so you can refill this it says visit FentySkin.com for recycling and clean formula. I feel like this will last me a long 
long time just because I don't really go anywhere. And I just feel like if I do go in the sun, I don't know. I just feel like this is going to last me a long time. And I got all three products because these were the first three products that she came out with as far as skincare. So I wanted the full experience. But I've taken it out. And I'm assuming that it goes in here like this. Oh, and you turn it. Oh, y'all see that? So you open it. I mean, you close it. You open it. You close it. You open it just by twisting this little thing. So let's see. I'm just gonna just see. Okay, so that is how it comes out. Hmm. It feels really good. It doesn't feel sticky. It does feel moisturizing. Somebody said this had a smell. I don't smell anything on this. <laughs> it's a very light, light, light smell. I wonder what that is, but it's really, 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 really super light. It's not anything heavy. Or anything you'll kind of notice. It's kind of really, really light scent. It's not overpowering or anything. But it does say remove refill for product information. So let me see. Oh. So it has the ingredients and everything on the tube as well. So that's neat. So yeah. I'm going to put this back in here. And you make sure you lock it in so when you... you you can't press any product out. So I think this is a good product. Fenty, Rihanna, Riri, bad girl. Let me tell you, I like it. I like it. We're going to see how it does my skin. I'm going to strictly use this product for the month. I'm not going to use anything else on my skin. And we'll just see how my skin reacts to it. I don't know what that was. We'll see how my skin reacts to these products. Um... For $75 for three products, three high-end products, I don't think that's bad. I don't really notice a difference in my skin. I'm not going to come on here and say, oh, I noticed a difference. I don't notice. So, but I mean, we're going to see if it's just like the cleansers that I can buy from the um, stores or if this is a product i can see myself maybe i don't know if she's in sephora but she has majority of her other fancy makeup and stuff in sephora so i don't know why she would put her skincare in sephora but i'll see if i if this is a must have skincare product so i will come back to you guys within a month to tell you what i think of the products and when i i will give you an update of the sunscreen as well because i will be using the sunscreen when i go out into the sun so this is what's today it is come on give it a date i hate my phone my watch i think it's august the 12th so september the 12th i will come back to you guys and let you know what i thought of this product if i think it's worth buying um my skin does not feel way down it feels really good i it just feels like i have a fresh canvas to do makeup on if i wanted to do makeup it just feels like i have new fresh skin so we'll see and i'll come back like i said september the 12th and see if this brightened this up if i noticed any difference and i will take a before and after picture of my skin just so we can compare the two but yes i cannot wait to come back to you guys with a review and i know this has been a i have not done a skin um care video in a long long time so i'm eager to see the results of um how these products do my skin so i'm gonna get out of here i'm gonna go to bed honey this is key and you have watched keys plant life and i will see you in the next video bye